it does, it does a very specific use of very specific brick elements, but in a very mature and elegant way, almost poetic, very subtle, in which it allows um, the traditional full-bodied architecture to be contrasted with the porosity of the uh, brick hollowed elements in which the uh, relationship between open and close is somehow mediated through this kind of new skin. I have this feeling that when I am here, I am like inside of one big brick. It looks like a one piece. I think that uh, an architect is not able to, to choose uh, a material or a color. We always said that um, uh, our job is to find out what is exactly the material that is needed in that exact place. Inside, we have only three materials, main materials. This is the brick, which is everywhere, on the floor, on the walls, on the ceiling sometimes, even of the terraces, supported by the concrete columns and beams. And the last material is the steel, which we see in the shadow of the bricks. We were looking for a continuity with the old building, so it makes sense that uh, the material that uh, builds the, the new university was the same brick. We tried to find uh, a brick that was the same color of the old factory. A brick uh, made in coal ovens that was made near the city of Katowice. It was a design decision very important because we wanted um, a brick that talks by uh, itself about uh, the history of the place. It's the first time it's realized like this in Poland. It's completely unusual use of the brick, that you use the same material like you use for the bricks. I mean the clinker, but you create a different shape, a different element that was just only produced for this building. It was uh, something uh, what was the biggest challenge, I think, in this building, I mean the technical aspect. Another big challenge was this, that in this building there is no plaster. So everything what was built was finished. So if they built the wall from bricks, it was finished. There was no time to change something. If they built the concrete elements, they, they were finished. So it was very difficult to have the very good quality, but we managed to achieve really good quality in this building. Uh, something like a two months ago, I have a discussion with one of the students about a completely different subject. And on the end of the discussion, she told me, thank you very much for this building. We love to be there, and sometimes we forgot to leave this place. <laughs> 